I, like many people, was aghast, concerned, saddened by the invasion of Iraq. And I didn't understand why that happened. Um, I began looking at um, material in archives because little information was appearing in the newspaper at that time. Perhaps courtesy of 9-11, everyone was afraid to say too much or to say the wrong thing. I luckily ran into an archive, the National Security Archive in Washington, that was formed by a group of uh, retired reporters who thought it would be very helpful for uh, specialists and the general public to know what went on behind the scenes when people are unguarded and when they are in the moment and they're writing what they believe to be true. So I looked at this material, um, not from any one point of view, pro or con, but simply to assemble the material um, um, and pick certain ones to represent to people who also might be curious about what was going on and why. While I was looking in the documents for facts that could be useful, of course I noticed how many pages were completely redacted and um, would have a black square <laughs> or a white one, or um, as seen here, uh, one that could, could be read. Uh, this painting is about Iraq. It was um, about who is in charge of uh, detention um, and were there abuses. So that's what this file was about. Um, the red painting is about bin Laden. Uh, mm -hmm. This was a document before 9-11 that noticed that um, uh, hijackings were planned and one was forestalled because two of bin Laden's men were arrested. Uh, this one is about how um, well developed um, bin Laden's organization was. Here's what they look like when they're raw, <laughs> if you'd like. The, the form, the color is a connection. I would say these perhaps are more despairing. Um, Malevich, I, I'm no expert, but my sense was that um, he thought things could be solved and that they're, uh, with the right effort that things could be made much better. Later on, I don't believe he thought that, um, perhaps, but um, I think these are sadder paintings, um, but I wanted to um, salute the man who um, had things right, who solved things, um, and to perhaps acknowledge his disappointment, his eventual disappointment, mm -hmm. in my present. <laughs>